Earlier, John Pertzborn showed us some holiday traditions across the Midwest, but there's one town down in the Ozarks that has become the focal point for entertainment and music. And boy, is it gaining in popularity. Branson, Missouri, of course, made its reputation on summertime theaters and country music. But this time of year, the hilltop town is in the throes of an Ozark Mountain Christmas. A quick check of the license plates along Main Street will attest that Branson, Missouri has become an incredibly popular destination. This town of 4,000 has seen fantastic growth over the last 10 years. That's when Roy Clark opened his celebrity theater along Highway 76 as a compliment to the local shows that had played in town for years. We were the first celebrity theater, meaning that we brought people, booked people in uh, nationally known talent as opposed to the Presleys and the Ball Knobbers and uh, the Plumber family that, that had a family show. And I think to myself, what a wonderful world. In the last decade, Branson has grown by leaps and bounds. More than 20 theaters now line the Ozark Mountain hilltop. But the town still hasn't lost its charms. And this time of year, the town really puts on a colorful winter coat and celebrates an Ozark Mountain Christmas. The thing that makes Branson so special in itself is the countryside and the people. The countryside looks like Christmas uh, in the fall of the year, in the winter of the year. And the people are Christmas people year round. I'm talking about the natives. And they really make you feel like you're so at home here. It's easy to come here and get the spirit of Christmas because the spirit of Christmas in Branson is here year round. And so it's easy to come in and do an Ozark Mountain Christmas. It's the most wonderful time of the year. There are 20 Christmas shows in Branson, lots of country music to be sure, but as Branson has grown, so has the diversity of great entertainers putting down roots in the Ozarks. John Davidson is one of the newest members of the Branson Entertainment family. John has moved his family to Branson and opened his own theater. And for his Christmas show, his wife and daughter join him on stage. There's a wonderful spirit in these hills that we love. I'm raising my seven-year-old daughter here. That makes Christmas special. Another recent arrival makes his home at the Moon River Theater. After years on the road, Andy Williams has also made the move to Branson. I love this area. I like the people here. I like, I've done a lot of things in my life, and I don't, I don't long for the big cities anymore. I don't long to travel like I used to, to all the time to Rome and Italy and, and all over the world. So it's easier for me to settle in a small area like this than it would be for a lot of other people because I have done all the things I wanted to do. And the move to Branson has made it easy for Andy to produce his traditional Christmas show. With his Moon River Theater as home base, he's able to put on a show that was impossible to create when he was traveling on the road. You know, I would go from, from Thanksgiving and do a different city every day until, say, the day before Christmas. Um, there aren't too many days in there, so you do as many of them as you can, and, and we'd do like 15, 20 cities. You can only do so much. You carry a band with you, but you really can't carry scenery and snow and dancers and singers and props and costumes and everything. So this is the first year that I've been able to really do a full-blown 
Christmas show like a television show. I mean, the stage is beautifully uh, dressed. So it's, it's really a big, wonderful, I think, uh, Christmas show. If you can't get to Branson for Andy Williams' Christmas show, check your local listings from the Moon River Theater. The special will air on PBS December 9th or 10th, depending on your part of the country. Our thanks to Roy Clark, Tony Orlando, John Davidson, Andy Williams, and all the stars from Branson. And the Midwest Holiday Parade will return in just a moment.